Welcome back to what's left of the Bob family household. This is in surprisingly good spirits considering all the circumstances of the time paradox. The last time we left it off. Okay, well we have to pick up the pieces since now that Ross Bob's gone. Um, someone has to keep making the potions in the family. Not Nottapona has galloped far enough to learn the title of long distance runner. We never did anything with Nottapona and all the skills. Apparently she's been like working as a horse this entire time. Maybe we should take like Nottapona to a racetrack. Harry Hill seems to be in good health. Um, he's at work currently. Wait, no, no he's not at work. He's rereading the adventures of Ray Mundo. Harry, you're a grown man and it's like six in the evening. Why do you need to go to town hall to read a comic book? Uh, stop crying. You need to bring a horse to enter to compete. We have a horse. Oh, he's still crying. Pretty sure that's how that door opens. But he didn't go in with the horse. Yeah, get, get, no, get out of the riding class you paid $800 for. Mount the horse. He's still crying. This show is almost over, so the doors are closed. Uh, okay, let's let's go to this house. Ari, you're just gonna stay the night here. Um, because, you know, the snow is coming in something fierce. I, I hope the residents of this home are still alive. You know, so many people have died in this community that there is a fair chance this house could be abandoned. Okay, let's just, like, pass through the night with Harry. It's only... It's only 26 degrees. You know, like, it's 33 here, so, like, it's pretty hot. Like, don't let the snow fool you. Okay, mount the horse. Stop crying for the love of God. Come on, Harry, get on the- Oh my God, stop crying. Get on the horse. Yeah, he's dead. It's a shocker, but get on the horse. He didn't die for this. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? All right, Harry, go buy a different horse. Clearly this one ain't working. Uh, we have Lady Spur, Meteor. <laughs> no, Harry, don't get off this horse. No, Harry, enter the contest. Harry Hills are- Oh, you gotta be kidding me. After all- <laughs> Okay, uh, well, he's going to work now. Okay, yeah, that seems like the ideal time considering he has zero energy. He, he just got in a taxi, he just left the new horse. Can the horses enter the contest by themselves? Barbara blew herself up again. How? Hey, Barbara, go have a shower. Gee, like, Ross Bob was really keeping the family together before he left. Now there's just dirty dishes everywhere, the computer's broken, the toilet like reeks in the background. Oh, and it's Bob's birthday. Happy birthday, Bob Bob. You know, it's eight in the evening, you're just standing all by yourself, clapping in the snow. You know, that's the best possible birthday, to just realize you're old now. She's immediately... Well, that was a fast midlife crisis. <laughs> Happy birthday! Midlife crisis time! <laughs> Waluigi discovered how to make a classic snowman. Good job, Waluigi. Why is the only option to destroy? There isn't enough flat space to build an igloo on this lot. What are you talking about? There's loads of flat space. Yeah, it's because it's because of like the ceiling arrangement we have. It's sheltering us from the snow. Okay, now they can live their dreams. You know, they have more snow to work with. Cause they all keep asking for an igloo. So let's make a freaking igloo. Okay, Barbara. <laughs> Potion doesn't seem to have gone well for Barbara again, but he's not letting that stop her, you know? Barbara just discovered how to make a Grim Reaper snowman. Oh, God. <laughs> well, if this isn't a sign of what's to come, I don't know what is. Barbara is dreaming of death every night. She works in a graveyard. And she's now made a Grim Reaper snowman. Okay, well, Bob Bob's making a snowman as well. Harry is, is like, getting in on the game. Becoming more logical for Barbara Barbara. You know, like, what an opportunity to arise when, like, she has this profile picture. Yeah, you, you get on that. But first, make another snowman, you know? Harry has left work. Harry earned $8 today. That does not seem good. Oh! No, maybe that's why he only made $8 today. <laughs> no, yeah, he just died at work. <laughs> Oh no, it begins. We've lost Harry. Someone made a lovely igloo here. Okay, well let's check out the snowman Barbara built, because apparently the game really wanted me to see this. Yeah, that, 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 that's beautiful, Barbara. I'm glad Harry Hill died for this. Well, just keep making snowman, Barbara, you know? Like, you seem to be having the time of your life doing this. Just navigate the satellites of food. Going for a sleep, apparently. 
No, she's going to pass out. Why did she walk next to the beds and just pass out there? Okay, well that, you know, that looks like a great place for a nap. Okay, Waluigi just discovered the Grim Reaper snowman and it just immediately reminded him of the passing of Harry Hill. Okay, well good job Waluigi, just, just make him a snowman. Uh, our lawn is looking pretty good right now, if I do say so. In two more days, snowflake, d s snowflake day will be upon us. Oh god, before we get to that- Oh no, we lost another one. Why did Gruntilda die? Bob Bob just saw the ghost of Gruntilda, Bob. Yeah, Bob Bob, she's right there. You don't need to make a memory out of this and like, share this memory. You know, oh, Gruntilda Bob just died, you know? And if you like the Gruntilda Bob died, make sure to like the video, leave a comment, and subscribe. And you know, sh retweet it on Twitter. Uh, make sure to share the post on Facebook. You don't need to just share every moment, Bob Bob. Just let her die in peace, you know? Afraid Bob gets it. As he's like hollering. Oh god, we're down to six surviving family members. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> okay, make that five surviving family members. Oh my god! Wait! He's here! Wait, what's he trying to do? Wait, no, Afraid Afraid Bob's the only one that's awake right now. You know, these two are the most beloved, because they're the only ones who have Twitch emotes. Oh, Bob Bob just got up. Be angry about her lack of sleep. Okay, okay, Bob Bob. Th th this is why you don't have the emote. Oh my god, bless his heart. Ross Bob just came back from the dead to feed the cat. He's actually the sweetest man alive. Even when he's dead, he's the best character <laughs> in the entire family. Just look at this, they're having a moment. He's playing chase with Afraid Bob. I love how he's just stolen the show away from Gruntilda dying as well. Like, no one cares that Gruntilda's dead. It's just the fact that Ross Bob is back. Ross Bob and Bob Bob just sharing a beautiful little moment here. Look at this. This is the sweetest thing. Oh god, they made a snowman of dead. Wait, it's Bob's birthday. No, hang on, no, you, you gotta... Wait, no, don't, don't leave us yet. No! We've- we've mourned the death of, like, Ross Bob, like, pretty much, like, every stream. And it- it's- it's just always so sad. Stop mourning the death of Gruntilda, we don't care about her! Ross Bob died again! Mourn the other one, Waluigi, get your priorities straight, you're gonna be next otherwise. Oh, pull yourself together, man! Okay, Barbara Barbara, how you doing, Barbara? <laughs> Jeez! Yeah, no, I think she's just dead. <laughs> She's been here this entire time. Oh, she's frozen solid? <laughs> oh, I thought she just passed out. Ironically, she was on her way to make ice cream. And then she froze. Okay, well, Luigi's got the hair dryer. You know, it might take a while. She doesn't look too good, I'm gonna be honest. I think she's co lit covered like frostbite. Oh no, no, she's just going to die. Like, let's be real, second to Ross Bob, like, Afraid Bob is the best character. I mean, he's put in so much work, like, he's realized all of his dreams. Okay, how's Barbara getting on with the snowman? Oh, god damn, Barbara, not again. <laughs> oh, Waluigi, go get the hairdryer. God damn it, Barbara. You... He didn't even finish the snowman. Ah, nice little 100 bits, roof. But we can't make the snowman if we put the roof back on. Roof, 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 get a roof, roof. All right, fine! You guys want a roof? How's that? Huh? Hey, RT, get a roof for the home. Perfect, the house is sheltered again. Beautiful. Bob has reached elder status. She can now start thinking about retirement and basking in the glow of her accomplishments. Bob Bob's all grown up. Oh, it's not opponent's birthday too. Oh, bless. Okay, Bob Bob, stop crying. You should be celebrating. It's your birthday. It's your bur happy birthday! Oh, look at this. They've made friends. Go sniff the raccoon. I miss Boinky Bob. <laughs> yeah, we never saw Boinky again. I don't know what happened with him. Bob's toy. Oh my god, pick up Boinky! No, you're right, it's the toy- Wait, what are you- How is this Boinky Bob? This was Boinky Bob all along. Oh 
my god! He just came to life! What? He was a toy all this time! <laughs> He's a real boy! The modern day Pinocchio in the Bob family household. I can't believe he's back in the household. As if nothing's changed. Bob Bob at the end of her life now. <laughs> Having a birthday party. <laughs> Boinky just. Boinky just aged. What? Boinky just became a fatter Boinky. I have another birthday party. Not a poet just backed up her arse into Boinky. What is going on? Why is Boinky aging? Boinky's even taller now. Why? <laughs> he has to be the same age as Bob Bob. Is that why he's having so many birth? He's having another birthday. Oh my god. So, are you telling me because we took Boinky out of Bob Bob's pocket? Boinky is now just an old man, who's just aged rapidly. Here we go again. How old is the toy? Boinky's back just gave out. Boinky's an old man. Okay, Bob Bob. Yeah, we have, we have to see if we can make a potion for this. Oh, he's imaginary, so only Bob Bob can see him. Oh yeah, so look at this, so if I click on Barbara. Okay, yeah, so, okay, so it's up to Bob Bob to make Boinky real then. Uh, we have to make the potion. Oh god, because yeah, he's an elder now. We're not going to make him a real boy if we make this potion. We're going to make him like a real old man. Yeah, well, why would we cut over to... <gasps> no! Oh, not Waluigi. Why are you so happy about this? Oh, we lost Waluigi. They're all dropping. Why? I don't know why she was happy about it. At least Waluigi seems very okay with this. Well, you know, we still got a few family members, so like, we should be okay. Yeah, go grab some floor waffles. Waluigi's last meal. <laughs> he made it for the family, bless his heart. Oh my god, he's back! Oh, poor Ross Bob, he just wanted a nap. <laughs> He's back from the dead, and he's just like having a sleep, and Barbara's like really upset. Oh god, it's Gruntilda as well! <laughs> this is why we have the extra beds. You know? You never know when all the spirits are gonna come back. It's just so sad, like, watching the family come to its eventual demise. Like, they've been through so much at this point now. It's nice that we have Bunky around to help out with the house. The pets are still, like, as well as ever, which is great. Cat's having some social problems. Is that sound? Um, it's just Barbara snowboarding. Oh no, it's Gruntilda snowboarding. Boinky's having another birthday party as well. Hang on. Why is it- like, why is every day Boinky's birthday now? Like, what's going on? There isn't enough flat space to build an igloo. Well, that's okay, because we just- we didn't need this anyway. Ross Bob's the one who used that anyway, alright? Like, he's not getting much use out of it now, I'm just saying. We need more igloos. How long can she keep this up? So it seems like relatively okay, despite the, like, amount of these she's had to build. <laughs> Deep in the red, but it's okay. We can still salvage the How the hell did Bob Bob die? How did Barbara outlive her? Oh god, what happens to Boinky? Nimsy. Oh my god. This is the worst timeline. <laughs> Two deaths in one. It's just Barbara. Barbara Barbara is somehow the longest standing member of the Bob family household. Which is freaking ridiculous if you consider how many times she like passed out of hypothermia and froze while making those snowmen. He's dreaming of death. It is kind of worrying how many of our thoughts are consumed by just tombstones and the morgue. <laughs> we should just. <laughs> oh, I guess. I guess that was a long sleep she was having. Oh, this is it. Shouldn't have burnt the meal she was cooking. She's begging for her life. Will she get it? 
Nope. Nope, she didn't get it. Oh no, it's just the pets and freaking Boinky. And Boinky's trapped in the doll. Oh, this actually might be it. The horses have to go to the racetrack for food. Afraid, Bob? I don't know how he's supposed to get food. Is there anyone left in the city? <laughs> well, I think all the neighbors are dead. There's a social worker coming! There are no more adults living in the household. The social worker is coming to take away any remaining pets or children. Oh no. Oh, you're kidding me. It just ends. The Bob family household. Is no more. Isn't this just some cheery, upbeat music as well? The Bob family household is dead. Oh, that's it, folks. Uh, I hope everyone has enjoyed the Bob family household. Season two, season two, <laughs> season two. <laughs> now, here's the thing I want to make clear: I, I don't plan on bringing the entire Bob family household back. Because I want this little series to stand on its own. I don't want to drag it out until its eventual demise where everyone's sick of it. Where it's like 40 parts. But Bob Family Household is done. What I may do is perhaps sort of like a side thing. With just Ross Bob and maybe just the pets. Gonna be a little bit before that. This is the finale though of the Bob Family Household. I, I, I am leaving it there. I'm not bringing them all back. If I ever do this again, it'll be different. Uh, I just want to make that clear. I have no intentions to just drag it out forever. Because I think that would kind of ruin the charm that this series has had. And I'm really happy with how it currently stands. I think that was a really good finale. I knew everyone was going to die going into it. But like, <laughs> you still have to see it, you know? You still have to see it with your own eyes.